Hey, welcome back to my channel. Just want to do an unboxing of the Foxier Falcor Mini. And this is going to go into my 7-inch build coming up. So let's uh, open this up here. Quite a, quite a package job. Looks like there's some foam inside there. You get a looks like a greetings and a thank you in, in English and some information cards about some wiring. Oh my. Don't have any fingernails, so Tweezers are always readily available. All right, got a little protective cap on the lens. Now, just to give you an idea, here's a, a micro. See the little bit of difference between there? <laughs> All right. So you have your your voltage coming in, so you can run it off battery voltage up to looks like you're able to go five to forty volts. Let me give you a close up of that data plate here. Twelve hundred TV line. Switchable between 4.3 and 16.9. And I have the 1.8 millimeter lens. Let's see what else is in the box here. It's pretty, pretty compact stuff, huh? All right, we got instruction sheet all kinds of data and some of the settings and what they mean some of the capabilities I can uh, I can get you a better picture of that if you need it nothing left in there so Let's see what we got in here all right, I'll be using that. So that is 28 millimeters. My frame, the iFlight frame that I'm using, the XL8, is from plate to plate is 29. If you can see that, fit right between there. So I'll be using this carrier carriage. like you get well, it looks like you get two wire harnesses yeah, it looks like some nice silicone wire quite a decent amount of length I'm not sure I would use that for my quadcopter but uh, there it is and then the other one looks like the same and now there's a different connector on the end quite a bit of length as well but Let's take a little closer look at the connector. So we have this one with a Molex that would fit the clear TX, uh, say the version one. And this one would be the TBS Unify VTX connection. So yeah, we have a uh, voltage sensor. So this wire would go to your uh, voltage so the camera can read that. It has a built-in OSD in it, so timer and, uh, and voltage. Um, let's see here. So first one is your voltage sensor wire, and then we have the connector for your 
control board for settings. And then the yellow is for the video in. I should say video from the camera. Black is your ground and then red for your 5 to 40 volt. So yeah. I will probably end up using 20% of this bundle here. Just looking a little closer here at the wires and thinking this this Molex on the end uh, goes to the version 1 and if you depin that and use this Molex for the clear TX version 2 the pins won't fit in that Molex so I'm not sure exactly what they were thinking so I'll have to figure that out a little bit more but you have all your hardware for your bracket to mount it to the camera it looks like everything's here that you would need and and more so yeah I really appreciate you checking out my channel and uh, and seeing this I can get you a better picture of this if you want uh, but yeah I really appreciate your time and I hope this is something that was useful to you and please remember to uh, put a comment in or a question I'll try to answer anything I can but uh, I'm looking forward to putting this into the uh, to the 7 inch build and seeing what it looks like through this camera so have a good day I appreciate your time Thanks.